Hey YouTube and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a little bit of a different video. I'm actually doing an outfits video as you guys can tell from the title. Today I'm going to be recreating Pinterest sixth form outfits for you guys. Just to give you guys a little bit more of inspiration or things to wear, I'm sure by this point in the school year, especially for year 12, you'll probably feel a bit redundant with what you're wearing to school and you probably want a bit of inspiration, especially for those of you that go to a school with a business wear dress code. This video is purely for those people that go to a school with a business wear dress code but also if this is your fashion sense this like dark academia pound stew very much blazer parisian type of vibe is your style outside of school too then do continue watching because you could probably also wear this out too I am also planning on doing a video for people that don't go to a school with a business wear dress code so do look out for that video but this video is specifically for the girls and the guys that have to wear blazers to school like me and with that being said i'm gonna stop rambling and we're just gonna get straight into the outfits and how i've styled them we created them so i have all the pictures on my ipad but i'll put the pictures up on the screen for you guys so you guys can also see it the first picture i have contains a boot clay blazer or an oversized blazer i'm gonna style it as a boot clay one because that's what i have um she's also wearing a turtleneck and a skater skirt in terms of accessories like the hair i'm not gonna style according to accessories however if you guys do want to do feel free to also copy her and do the whole headband situation thingy but i'm not going to be doing that in this video i'm just gonna focus solely on the outfit so yeah let's get on to the first outfit so this is outfit number one i thought i'd add my school bag just to give you guys a little bit more context of how the outfit would look but yeah very very cute in the picture she obviously had hers um buttoned but i don't know i feel like it's, it, it gives me a very boxy vibe let me know what you guys think in the comments but i prefer it unbuttoned like that but yeah very very cute outfit details about where i got everything from this boucle blazer is from h&m i was gonna say zara but it's actually from h&m h&m and zara are where like i get my parisian french type of like fashion style pieces the tie today is, is actually from zara and it's quarter length so which i find very very cute i find the quarter length the quarter length thing does it for me i don't know i personally like it like that and the skirt is from where's the skirt from asos the skirt is from asos the only thing that i would say about this skirt is that it doesn't fit around my waist properly so i always have to tie it with a band and it makes the back short because i have to tie it which kind of bothers me like i want to get a new one that just fits my waist but yeah that is it for the first outfit okay now for outfit number two this outfit i wouldn't say is one of my favorites but as you can see she's also wearing a skate skirt most of these outfits that i have involve skater skirts because i guess that's like the pinterest vibe the whole skater skirt blazer oversized blazer tie type of vibe but yeah with this outfit she's wearing a skater skirt a mini skater skirt a tie and a shirt and then like a bomber jacket i'm obviously not going to style this with a bomber my jacket because this is for school her shirt is also crop um i don't know about you guys but this outfit in terms of the jacket and the shirt wouldn't fit my school's dress code i've paired this with a regular school shirt i've got a tie but it's not black and i used a blazer instead of the bomber jacket and yeah And this is outfit number two. I obviously used a gold tie rather than a black tie because I didn't have a black tie. And I kind of like the pop of color that the gold tie gives. This outfit, I can't lie, is not one of my favorites because it just gives me very much secondary school vibes because when I went to secondary school, we wore ties. In fact, this tie is one of the ties I wore in secondary school. However, if you didn't wear a tie in secondary school, this might be appealing to you, something different because you're not used to wearing a tie. But yeah, I do think it's a very like cute cute school girl type of fit i wear it with my school bag to give you guys more of a view of it my bag is so flat it's actually it looks weird because it's flat but i'm not i don't have school so there's nothing inside of my bag but yeah this is what it would look like it is a very cute it's cute details i got a blazer from h&m tie from my old school shirt from h&m and skater skirt from asos as you guys would already know so yeah this is outfit number two i'm going to show you guys what this outfit would look like without a skater skirt if you 
you don't really want to wear a skirt skirt you don't really like skirt skirts i'm going to show you how it would look like with just a regular plain skirt so this is the outfit with a regular pencil skirt and i personally i can't lie i prefer it it definitely looks better to me i would wear this one to school i wear it with the school bag so you guys can see what it looks like like that so this is what it's like with the bag yeah i put i personally i like this one i do but yeah that is outfit number two with a skater skirt and with a pencil skirt i've just realized i didn't even give you guys the details about the skirt this skirt is from new look if i can find it i will link it down below now for outfit number three she's wearing an oversized sweater vest a beige one she's wearing a black turtleneck and a skater skirt again i'm not going to pair this with a crossbody bag because school you obviously wouldn't wear this with a crossbody bag if you're going to school i didn't have a plain colored oversized sweater vest i have a houndstooth one instead so that's what i used but overall i really do like this outfit like the way she styled it i like the pop of color from the beige and then the all black from everything else with mine it didn't really give that effect because obviously the houndstooth was black and white but yeah i just styled this with a houndstooth um oversized sweater vest instead okay, skirt and the black turtleneck or like high neck i didn't exactly have a turtle neck but it was high neck but yeah that was outfit number three outfit number three i didn't have a plain colored oversized sweater vest i have a houndstooth one instead i just put on this necklace that i have from warren james just to put something here because it was just very dark and i just thought something needs to just shine here so i put this necklace on this outfit i won't lie it's not one of my favorites it's just not giving all the way the way i want it to but i'll give you guys the details this black high neck jumper i have is from h and m the houndstooth oversized sweater vest is from ASOS. As you guys already know, the skater skirt is from ASOS. I do have another variation for you guys. I'm going to wear it with the white turtleneck that I showed you guys from the beginning. I personally prefer it with this um, top, this turtleneck. So this is the second variation of outfit number three. I I don't know, this outfit bangs. I've never even, I've never thought to style my hamstring sort of vest like this. This outfit is seeing me in school. It's just giving really. Also, I tied it up at the back. I just feel like the oversized thing wasn't just, it wasn't looking good. It just wasn't looking right, really. This is the second variation of outfit number three. Let me know in the comments which one you guys prefer. You already know I prefer this one. So now guys, for the fourth outfit, this definitely is one of my favorites. I really like this one. I really like this one. And I think I'm actually even gonna wear this to school. That's how much I like it. She paired the outfit with, again, um, a sweater vest, but hers is an oversized, it's fitted, but because I didn't have one, I just altered mine a little bit. Um, she's wearing a white turtleneck and then some trousers. I think this is literally the only outfit that I have that includes trousers. Everything else is literally skater skirt, skater skirt, skater skirt, skater skirt, 24 seven. But like I said before, I guess that's the Pinterest vibe. Okay, so outfit number four. I feel like I definitely need to get a smaller, a less oversized sweater vest. I tied it at the back just to give it the cropped feel and it looks really good as cropped. I tried it on as oversized. I'm not about to show you guys that because it's not cute. The trousers are from H&M. Surprise, surprise. And obviously, I forgot to mention in the picture, she has a long sleeved one. If you want to style it with a long sleeve one, do go ahead. I feel like it looks good with the quarter length. Like imagining long sleeve in my brain, I feel like the quarter length looks better in my opinion. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. But yeah, guys, those are all all of the outfits that i have for you today i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you guys could find something in your wardrobe or maybe you want to buy something and kind of recreate these outfits or copy them if you guys like to see fashion videos from me do make sure to stay tuned because i have more of those types of videos coming out if you're interested in my personal fashion sense do make sure to go and follow me on instagram also active on there soon i will be active on tiktok if you want to follow me in the meantime um everything will be down in the description box below and everything i wore in this video then wherever i got everything from will be linked down below and make sure you check the description box before clicking off this video in case you wanted to get anything with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed today's video comment down below what outfit you're planning to recreate or copy yeah make sure you like and subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys in the next video